I'm Donna Schwartz, a member of United Women in Faith and the Board of Trustees. This week, we're talking about foolish love is unfair. An example is in Mark 7, 24 to 30, Common English Bible. An immigrant's daughter is delivered. Jesus left that place and went to the region of Tyre. He didn't want anybody to know he had entered a house, but he couldn't hide. In fact, the woman whose young daughter was possessed by an unclean spirit heard about him right away. She came and fell at his feet. The woman was Greek by birth. She begged Jesus to throw the demon out of her daughter. He responded, The children have to be fed first. It isn't right to take the children's bread and toss it to the dogs. But she answered, Lord, even the dogs under the table eat the children's crumbs. Good answer, he said. Go home. The demon has already left your daughter. When she returned to her house, she found the child lying in the bed, and the demon was gone. Jesus had come to save the lost sheep of the house of Israel, not the Gentiles. Since she was a Greek and a Canaanite, this mother didn't have the right to ask for healing for her daughter. This mother was an exception. She earned the right to a blessing through her faith. Jesus lets us know that after his death and resurrection, all people will have access to him through faith. I am reminded of the breakthrough prayer that we are praying at St. Mark's. Pray with me. God of new beginnings, as we rest in your presence, prepare room in our hearts for your holy breath. May your spirit inspire our next steps in following your will. Amen.